in the world where you're about to enter, you embark on a grand adventure with you as the hero. Speak to people and check things wherever you go. Be it, be it towns, roads, or caves. Gather information and hints from every source. New paths will open to you by helping people in need, overcoming challenges, and solving mysteries. At times, you will be challenged by others and attacked by wild creatures. Be brave and keep pushing on. <coughs> Through your adventure, we hope that you will interact with all sorts of people and achieve personal growth. That's our biggest objective. Press the A button and let your adventure begin. Hello there. Glad to meet you. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. People affectionately refer to me as the Pokemon Professor. This world is inhabited far and wide by creatures called Pokemon. For some people, Pokemon are pets. Others uh, use them for battling. As for myself, I study Pokemon as a profession. But first, tell me a little about yourself. Now tell me, are you a boy or a girl? Let's begin with your name. What is it? Right. So your name is Sean. Yes. This is my grandson. He's been your rival since you, you both were babies. Um... What was his name now? Uh, was it Gary? Yes. That's right, I remember now. His name is Gary. Sean. Your very own Pokemon legend is about to unfold. A world of dreams and adventures with Pokemon awaits. Let's go! How's it going, everybody? The Mirror Shield here, brightening up your day. Now, there's a specific reason I didn't talk during any of that. Or, like, I didn't casually talk. And I just wanted to put my own touch on it, I don't know. Sean played with the NES. Okay, it's time to go. Uh, sleep. No, just kidding. Put up the PC, and there should be a potion right here. So, as if an anybody didn't know that. Um, so yeah, this is my let's play of Pokemon Fire Red. Let's talk to our mom. Mom, alright, boys leave home someday. Said so on TV. Well, not everything on TV is true, so, uh, you know. I could just sit back and stay here for a while. No, I'm kidding, I can't. Okay, yes, Professor Oak next door was looking for you. Now there's one thing I want to change. I would like to change text speed to fast, because that's really annoying me. And I will change this. Um, I like that. Uh, I'll stick with that. I might change it. If you notice, tell me in the comments, please. So, uh, hey, look, a lab. Oh, well. Let's keep going. Wait, hey, wait. Don't go out. It's unsafe. Wild Pokemon live in tall grass. You need, a, you need your own Pokemon for your protection. I know. Here come with me. Uh, okay. That's cool, too. I will gladly come with you, I guess. Uh, well, hey, look, it's Gary. Gramps, I'm fed, I'm fed up with waiting. 
Gary, let me think. Oh yeah, that's right, I told you to come. Just wait. Here, Sean. There are three Pokemon here. Haha. The Pokemon are held inside these balls. Pokeballs. Not just balls, Pokeballs. Gotta get it right, man. When I was young, I was a serious Pokemon trainer, but now, in my old age, I have only these three left. You can have one. Go on, choose. Hey, Gramps, no fair. What about me? Be patient, Gary. You can have one, too. And, um... There's three. There's Bulbasaur, who is kind of a defensive Pokemon. It's a little bit more special attack, I guess. Depends. I don't know. It's, it's pretty good. I like it, but I will not be choosing it. Then there is Squirtle. Squirtle is defensive and he is quite good. Um, no, I do not. And there is Charmander. Charmander is a fire type. He is my favorite, but I will be. Mm, you know what? You know what? I'm gonna choose Charmander. So, maybe unoriginal, it may be whatever, but I choose Charmander. Because he's Charmander. I will not be giving him a nickname right now. I'll take this one then. Gary Seed Squirtle from Professor Oak. Okay, let's just leave. Wait, Sean, let's let's check out our Pokemon. Come on, I'll take you. Oh great, this doesn't seem good. So uh Um Oh, for Pete's sake. So pushy as always. John, you've never had a Pokemon better. Have you? Let... Uh, I don't know. A Pokemon medal is when trainers pit their Pokemon against each other. A trainer that makes the other trainer's Pokemon faint by lowering their HP to zero wins. But rather than talking about it, you'll learn more about it. It's not that hard to figure this out. Even if you're 8 or 9 or 5 even, it's pretty easy to figure out. Just do, do an attack that you think would do the most damage. And, uh, yeah. So you just have to strategically get uh, the Pokemon down. And basically this first battle is just using, oh, I'm going to use Scratch every single time. Or I'm going to use Growl the lower as attacking them. Attack them every other time. You can do whatever you want. It's not very strategic yet. But, uh, yeah. What unbelievable. I picked the wrong Pokemon. Hmm, excellent. If you win, you win prize. You win prize money and your Pokemon will grow. Battle other trainers and make your Pokemon strong. Mwahaha. I beat you. <laughs> uh, Sean, Gramp, smell, smell you late. That's gonna be a catching thing. Uh, catching on theme for some reason. Now, hmm, we should go up here in the next episode. So, as short of an episode as it has been, I think we should leave it off right here. Even though it's only been nine minutes or whatever. It's still good. It's it's a good nine minutes, and uh, I hope you guys can uh, enjoy the rest of the series. Um, this is gonna be yeah. I'll I'll talk about that later. So I think that's the episode, and uh, you know, I guess I'll see you guys in the next one. I suppose you should guys should have a good evening. I definitely did. And I will see you in the next episode. Thanks for watching. This has been the Mirror Shield. But for now, farewell my Skylians.